you can't you can't like you know start start asking Daisuke what he Is was thinking when he designed these characters. The inner machinations of my mind are an enigma. That is bullshit. Crazy. Hello and welcome to another episode of This is the part you love <laughs> Crime Tina Critiques uh, Crime Tina Critiques, what is the game that we are doing today? Guilty Gear Guilty, Guilty Gear? Gear? Strive Yeah To it's be alive the, Strive to be alive Yeah uh, We did Guilty Gear, Revelator, Exard, whatever with Star mm-hmm. like a couple of years back oh, yeah. Is there a character she loves in this? Oh, they're not in this one okay. though. They, oh, they, well. she, wah, wah. she canonically got killed, I think. Uh, and I got really depressed when people told me that. There's like a story. Like where do you? There's a lot of story. There's a story mode that has no fighting game in it. Oh. You just watch things happen. I, I wanna, Intricate. I wanna, I wanna do it when I have a chance. But uh, because Guilty Gear, for whatever arc system works, doesn't want to have a model viewer. Boo. Boo. We'll just have to make a do with training. Uh, at least you get to see the garments in motion. You do. No, it doesn't you matter. Do. No, you do. <laughs> it's fine. Um, so this this is the main menu. <laughs> sorry, sorry. I just see one of the characters, and um, right away I'm seeing, I'm feeling something. You're seeing something like he, yeah. he they, they throw him right in the middle. But first, like we'll take a look at the character on this screen because they're very close up. Yes. Nagori Yuki. Uh, what, what do you see about this character? What is their name? What is their status? Let's go from there, and then we'll go into game. And we'll get a better look at their at their actual character model. But what do you what are you seeing here? Um, a noble vampire samurai, baby. You got a lot going on. Can you read what's above that? Uh, I got his, my gla- my glasses got on. Glasses on. His blood sucking blade delivers <laughs> a devastating blow. So, so do you. <laughs> okay. <laughs> First of all, yes. Okay, yes. <laughs> but no, but like his blood sucking blade. So aren't all blades like blood sucking when you think, think about I it? I think it. Okay, listen, everyone. Because a blade will cut you and you you bleed. Listen, everyone. I played Strive maybe like two matches. I don't know anyone's story. You can't come at me. I was just gonna no say, do you know come anything about any of these characters? I, I'm just gonna say no, and okay. that gives me a, a clear pass. Yeah. No one can complain. But this is Carte the, Blanche. Carte Blanche. This is Nagori Yuki. We're gonna take okay. two Nagori Yukis. Double, um, double, double the double. New York <laughs> Nagori Yuki yeah, pleasure. There's so many. This is getting out of hand. Now there are two of them. Um, um and yeah, that's so fun. Shadow Nagori Yuki and like. But look, let's look at the eagle. Okay. It's going. He's doing. It's two Yukis, mm. and uh, I I have things set, so we have all the bars and stuff gone. Oh, but, look at that clean. But, but this it's is It's very this cartoony. Guy. It's very it like is, this is a cartoon. Yeah. yeah. He does have his mask off. I, I don't, I think I can only do that Sorry, if I do a he super has his meter. Mask off? I know, oh, I mean, he, he can, can have up. his mask off. Uh, but, th- but this is him. He's a brand new character in this particular game. Okay, so he's, he's like, he acting brand new. Like, he's brand new. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. Well, a couple of things right off the bat... So I like how he has like one sleeve on and the other one like free, but like mm-hmm. tied with a little ropey. So it's like he doesn't know if he's hot or if the air conditioning's on too high at, at the brunch place. So he like has one arm free. It's multifunctional. Breathing. Yeah, and the other one like covered in case it gets cold. Mm-hmm. Um, I like how he has his little um, like dread ponytail, kind of peacocking. A little you know what bit, I mean? yeah. Um, I guess his mask is pretty cool. It has horns. Um, I'm not loving. Uh, what do you think I'm not loving? You're not loving the multicolored belts. Yes. Thank you. Thank you for elaborating that it's not just that they're multi belts, but they're also multicolored, multicolored and um, like consistencies. Like, you know. I, I think for the character I'm controlling, I took a different 
player color, but the it, one it the one matter. on the right is is yeah is because the, is the main the belt color. and buckle is like a black or dark brown with like a gold square, and then you decided to go silver for the harness ones and a different color, but like. Mm, okay, yeah. and and then like the flap, I, I don't know how to explain it. The flap like the right flap. under the belts of the same color. Okay, so let's go with the orange guy on the right, okay? So you know how like under the double belts, there's kind of still some orange material with yeah, a little no, bit I of a blue? Yeah, I see it, yeah. Mais quoi? Like what is that? I don't know. Why is that there? I don't know. Yeah, nobody does. It's a. Li- it gets a little messy around there. For me personally, I know that when I boot up a game, if someone doesn't have at least two belts, then I'll know that someone was slacking mm-hmm. uh, because mm-hmm. they they like they that's what they just like to layer on all the time. Um, but in terms of a samurai, especially when we we play Tekken games, when people had layers on top of layers and they had different patterns and prints on it, this is actually quite simple. Still, at kind the end of, of the but day. there's an unnecessary amount of flaps. Like even the one in his little puss area on his thigh. Like why is that flap down? Why is that there? Um, I really love the top. Like I'm looking more at the jacket and I like the studding and the cut of the lapel and the kind of kimono sleeve. Like I actually love the top part of this. We're gonna go with quadrants. So the top quadrant (laughs) has a big A plus for me. And then anything below first belt is not doing it for me. That's fine. Like the sneakers are actually kind of cute, but I'm not gonna, the whole bottom part's a mess. Okay. What do you give them overall, just based on this? Like a half and half. So I don't know, somewhere in the middle, like a six? Somewhere in the middle. I Like a meh. It's, it's, it's interesting because he's a very unique character for Guilty Gear, but at the same time, you're not exactly wrong because there's another character, if you remember from before, Biken, who is like a samurai woman with the titties the out. Yeah, with yeah, the yeah. boobies, yeah, yeah, yeah. You just know, the boobies. Yeah, yeah, I know, the boobies. And she's like much more of a like it. all-together design. She's not yeah. in this game, at least she's not yet. She's more cohesive. She's more cohesive. So you give uh, Nagoriyuki like a middle yeah, of the room. Yeah, yeah. Like, he's not the worst, obviously. No, he's not. We'll see some worse, for sure. I oh. know there's a character you hate in Guilty Gear. I feel like it's coming. So I can't wait to see that. He has an impressive torso, too. So, uh, so do I. Give him that. Yeah, yeah. Yes, that's what I say. <laughs> Melia Rage. All right. This is the one. Like, I don't know if we're recording, but this is the one when I saw it. Now we I see recording. here. I see it here. But I'm like, why is it? What's her name from Mystery Shack? Or from Oh my Robin God. Jeez, uh, what's her name? The one with the, the funny hat. Exactly. Like, in the, in the little thumbnail, it looks more like her because she has a hat and the red hair. Uh, but this is Amelia Rage. Uh, she's been around for a while. Has her she? hair is her weapon. Lots of fighting game ladies, their hair is their weapon. You can see it it, it strikes and stuff. If you remember when we pl- when we played Skullgirls. Yes. Yeah, you know, very much very much that. But yeah, that's that's kind of her deal. She's had a million different looks actually. Really? Well, not so, a mi- not a million, but she's but had do, a couple. They all have this like military sort of Russian design. No, no, uh, Russian maybe she's never had this uh she didn't have this hat previously. Mm-hmm. She just had a uh ribbon in her hair uh, like uh, on her forehead. But this is like her her current this design. This is her uh, winter runway look. Yeah, this is like she's like in Montreal for all winter. Yes, she just yes. has to has to do her best. <sighs> I think the hair is very cool. Like, that it goes into, like, braided and different things, and it's functional in the fighting, like, in the actual yeah, yeah. gameplay. Okay, so I like the cut of the garment. I like her hair. I even like the boots. They're kind of, like, elevated wellies, like, elevated rain boots Elevated almost. wellies. You should yeah. copyright that. Um, but the one thing about it, and I'm of two minds, is that the hair and the hat and coat are all kind of the same color palette, which is a very, like, beigey thing, so it kind of washes her out. You're not wrong. And, you know, I'm very like, oh, why do they pop this color here? It's weird. But if her hair had been, like, a bright red, maybe. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Like, it would have stood out from the rest of the outfit and would have... I just feel like she's a little washed out by this palette because it's all neutrals. Okay, well, that's that's for colors. What do you think about all the, the little dangly bits on the front that, that go down in a line. No, see, those are fine because they're You're cohesive. Fine. They're in a line. It's like a military classic double-breasted like look of something. And it's really not that busy. Okay, she has the armband and there's like, you know, they can help themselves with like the gloves and and a little kind of weird capelet that isn't really capelet. It's kind of like a piece of, no, it's a scarf. Yeah, it's a scarf. Yeah, that I think that so. is defying gravity because that's not how scarves kind of work. It's kind of under her. Yeah, her but it's not collar. attached around her neck. It's yeah. just kind of floating. 
That's floating. Oh, she got a crown. It kind of made out of hair. You would have that. I love that. What I you- think that's fun. Ooh. But again, with the, the, the scarf, then why didn't they pop it in a color? They made it another yellow, another pale You're not wrong. Yellow. You see she has a little splash of blue of the logo on her little uh, it's very arm sashlet. It's little, very faint. It's not like if maybe the scarf had been blue. Do you know what I mean? Like something Maybe, yeah. to break from like the neutral, like kind of washed out palette. But the design itself is very good. You, you, you like it, say, huh? I do like it. Yes. That's a big slash and a big. <gasps> And so that's a like for oh, me. Oh, yeah, that was hot. That was good. You that was that. good. Okay. So like, yeah, even if the color of, of the one in the blue's hair was on her, it would look so much better. Mm. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, no, I get you. I get you. Okay, but that's a, that's a big approve. I still like her. I still, her design is very good. Yeah, I think you liked her in the, in the last Guilty Gear game, so that makes sense. Chip, Chip Zana. Zana. All right, so the president of America, Chips Enough. Uh, he was actually my favorite Guilty Gear character for a while. I mean, Oof. I'm not. I don't consider my. I'm not saying oh. because I'm not saying because of fashion, but he's okay, like. No, I'm not saying that. I'm they, saying that. I'm seeing this weird nutsack belt. What is what's it? What's wrong with a nutsack belt? It helps accentuate. I feel very uncomfortable. Fair enough. It's a weird um, flesh-colored phallus eye. He's just, he's a ninja master. Yeah, and, but did he always have this? It wasn't that big. It wasn't belt. that big. I don't think it was that big. It, Ulti- it, Ultima it, will know if it was that big. It almost looks like intestines that got knotted. Or just a bunch of dicks. It's just weird <laughs> twisted up dickies. Uh, okay, but in terms of... Uh, let, let, let's not look I'm at the I'm trying box. really hard to see past it, okay? Give me a moment. Okay, that's fair. Do, 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 okay, well, do, do, he needs to stop moving so I can, like, judge okay. him properly. All right. I guess his hair is cute. He has a mask because he likes safety. He likes ninja safety. So I think his top is kind of like a um, motorcycle, classic moto cut, but, like, vest. Oh, was that a, was that a kitty? I think it's a tanuki. Oh. Uh, um, oh, when he has his arms up, you can see. Uh, and then there's, like, a necessarily... A necessary belt in the vest, and then it's belt in the pants. Though. It almost seems like there's might be suspenders under there. I hope I'm wrong. Um, I don't think so. I think yeah, it is kind of a biker cut, and I'm, I'm not sure if it's actual suspenders. Just a belt that's threaded through. God, but for the love of God, if you just weird intestine dicky belt wasn't there, like look how much better he would look. Just visualize it. Yeah, maybe maybe it is too big. You're you're not wrong. Like I get that if this is like part of his like outfit, his character's outfit, like cool. But like it, it, it scale is, it down, bitch. It is like, a very Japanese ninja y thing. I've seen belts like that. Like a rope other belt. Characters. Like a rope belt. Have like you that. seen them this big? It's bigger than I, his I fucking head. I have not head. seen it this big, but Arc System Works, well known for making it big. Uh, what do you think about his little little sandals, though? Little ninja sandals. I think they're cute. I think functional they're cute little thongies in the front but then have the straps across the foot like mm. i think they're actually cute and i love his little you know the puffy harem cut pants i'm sure that's something else in this you know fighting attire but like what I, what is what is your opinion on the collar that goes past the mouth and just under the nose is that like a statement of um, any type i feel like it's, it's okay it's okay all right. I feel like he's like trying to keep yourself warm in the winter. You know, you have your little dicky up. So many dickies. Too many. Too many dickies. Too many I dickies. cannot get over this. And like that it's not even kind of rope colored. It is it is intestine, like fleshy colored. I mean, it's kind of rope Like colored. they made a choice. No, rope color would be more of a, a brownie tone a, a, like yeah, than a maybe. pinky tone. Like some sausage links. Like I feel like having sausages. Like what are we? Like little breakfast sausages. No, I get you. I get you. You know. But is that leading towards where you think overall? Does it ruin it? Yeah, no, I'm sorry. It does. It does. Huh? For me, the, like the rest of the design, I'm trying to erase it from my mind. Like, but the fact is, it's there, and uh, they made this choice, this decision, and now they'll have to live with my verdict. So that would be a, just a no. It, it's going to be no. It's going to be no, dog. It's going to be Ooh, no dog for me. Dog. Okay. Everything else is actually pretty good. Soul, Soul bad, bad guy. guy. All right. So here is the Ryu. I, I and was gonna Ken. Say, he's like the and classic. Ken. He's like the face of the uh, Yeah. Franchise. Soul bad guy. This is Star's favorite character, I would say. No. He, he the, loves the fire and the lava. Someone with like a pumpkin she, hat? No, she likes Jacko as well. Yes, that's, that's like the, the female that she, yes. that she likes. But see, I know. 
the 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 big dude, the the hotness is is sole bad guy. I'm sorry, is this baby boy wearing some? Um, they're not even chaps. I was gonna say chaps, but they're I don't not connected. Even think they're chaps. No. So they're just like high thigh highs. No, they are chaps because look, they go on the side. <gasps> no, I thought that they're just little like flaps that are just hanging out. Yeah, that's what I thought too. But look, when he walks on the side, it's white up his thigh. No, I know. This but bitch I think is wearing he just chaps. has white pants on and then little red flappies on the oh. side. Like a but, dick window. But wait, when he's standing, why I'm is it sorry. black? When he's standing like I, this, why is it above the belt thing? Why is it black? You, you can't, you can't like, you know, start, start asking Daisuke what he is was thinking when flaps? he designed these characters. How many flaps? I'm There's so, so many flaps. Plus, his dick is free. It's Guys, right I haven't, I haven't even looked above his thigh. I'm I mean, still, you like, haven't even got there I'm yet. still mid-thigh looking down trying to figure out my life right now because... And then, like on top, what is this? What is this red thing covering his peen? Is it's it? A, it's is a, it a sorry, skirt? I, it's a dick uh, curtain. <gasps> oh. I think. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I, I don't know. You part it. You say hello. I think so. Fuck. Oh no. And then is he wearing like a weird scuba zip up top? <laughs> As- scuba. Zip up. You know what I mean? Like the scuba divers, they zip up. Yeah, no, no they I, zip in the back. Actually, I get but you. Like, but but he's your stereotypical. I'm a cool, tough guy, and no yeah, one's I'm the yeah, best. Yeah, yeah, you know, um, cool guys all wear bolero jackets. <laughs> bolero cut. If you can make right a, under the nip. To be fair, you have to be the bravest of them all to wear even a bolero. Gray, yeah, right. Basically, the crop top of jackets. Yeah. Um, shit, bitch. I mean, now you're, you're making me feel like, do I give him props for bravery? Because you you need to be confident. You he need to is, be brazen. He's overconfident, if anything. And what is this giant life preserver on his arm? <laughs> Just ready to, did, to I, save that drowning chipmunk. I did, I, did, you know, like, I did notice that. I'm not sure. I think that's In case just, of any small rodents are drowning. Yeah, I know. Soul bad guy would... Whip would it I, out. Would save them? I would think he? he would, I don't know, actually. I'm not sure how evil he is in this game. And like, or okay, he's not at all. So, and like, I'm trying to pan up and like, look. But like, his hair. So, it's like a... Party ponytail. party pony mullet. Party pony mullet. Yeah, because it, it is party in the front, but it's like yeah. a business ponytail in the back. What's that business ponytail? Um, it's high up, pulled tight. I don't know. Okay. I like party pony mullet. I I, yeah. I like where your head's at, I but I don't like... know if this ponytail can be business. I guess it can. And then there's this like weird sad ribbon just flopping around from his gun I, hilt. From, from his gun sword. Yeah, just a sword actually. But um, it's just flopping there because you want some visual like, like busyness. Because he's not busy enough. So I'm going to start with the pros. <laughs> okay. Kay. So Black, red, gold, white, all work. Perfect. Right? Color scheme, you you said it. You know me yeah, yeah, yeah. by now. It's a good color scheme. Um, so the fact that these uh, chaps or maybe they're just you know question marks boot cut pants I'm not even gonna say bell bottoms I'm not even gonna say flares we're gonna give them boot cuts but I feel like it's odd because the way they're textured it looks like it's emulating muscle but it can't be because well, like those aren't his calves but that's could just be anime but then as it goes up anyways so listen, a boot cut is flattering when you're wearing like little platform booties, like he seems to be. He is. Um, the dicky curtain with giant belt and belt plate in front. Uh, I don't, I don't know what that's about. <laughs> Why it needs buckles on the sides and going down? Still questionable. You need to lock it in. <sighs> you need to lock it. Do you down. need four? Four buckles on your glove. That's, you a stu- need, that's a stupid question. Do you need eight glove you buckles? Need, you need as many buckles that can be buckled. You need to buckle it the fuck down. Yeah. You need to lock down the penis. You need to lock down the ass okay. cheeks. Nothing can move. Um, But it's flapping and loose. It is so. flapping and loose. So, so what are you, you locking down, You've bitch. exposed him. Okay. Um, <laughs> then your, your little scuba, scuba vest and your... 
bolero buoyancy just <laughs> lifesaver girl are you in the ocean this is a lot of ocean feeding and he's for the me. fire guy he's not even the water ice guy that's a guy for later okay um i don't know how to feel what what is what is your gut what is the blood running through your bones telling you i mean i still kind of like it yeah i knew you would asshole i still like i'm just saying i'm just saying it's not without its flaws okay 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 it's not without its questions if you're to think i have a lot of them i know if you're to think of what your chibi's expression is what is your gut instinct i mean probably hard eyes because i mean he could get it hard eyes like okay, he could get, he could get it. it okay yeah I don't know. I'll, I'll, I'll make note of that. <laughs> yeah. Okay, good. So that's a he can get it yeah, for soul bad guy. I mean, Shocking no one. We'd have to take off all those flaps. I don't know. Take a <laughs> that's long That's going to take you a while. Got to pencil them in for like six hours. Kai Keys. All right, here's the water ice guy that I alluded to before. Mm-hmm. Kai Ki- Ki- Kai Kiski. Really? Because nothing about this says water or ice to me. Okay, no, I'm thinking of the guy from Blaze Blue. Oh my god. God damn it. Oh man, it's I don't I don't pick this character at all. Oh, okay. So a, you can tell that like, maroon. like the the stage like changes what mm-hmm. a character looks like so that that's that's it is blue, it is white, it is black. So that's that's Kai. Key. Whatever. I don't know, he's giving me quiz essential like brooding dark bad guy kind of. Shocking. He might not be bad guy, but quite less busy than Soul Bad Guy. Soul Bad Guy got more like yes. stuff over he's the game. He's very streamlined. He mm. his thing is uh his pant and shirt are one color. Do I love that they kind of flap out? I don't know if it's no, it's his boots at the bottom. I thought it was the pants that flapped out. Yeah, it's but his boots, right. It's his boots that are, have a fold over flap, which is fine. His little, like, Christianity symbols. You gotta represent. Represent Christ. You got Jesus on our necklace. <laughs> on our shins. On our shinsalas. What's in his pocket there? What is this? What is this thing in his heart? That's a sword hilt, I assume. Oh, when he turns. But he has a sword in his other hand, so... Well, he, he'll... He, he'll he, when, when it's not no longer business time, he'll put it away. Oh, okay, that... Ew. Okay, it's kind of the color of a sword. Anyways, I love a good caplet. Yeah, we're not, we're not gonna, yeah. you know, like not the fact find. that he's rocking these like shoulder pads slash epaulette vibe right here. Nice. Mm. Also, the fact that there's like a little black trim around the white. Open deep shirt. Detailing. A little bit. Oh, deep V. Deep V deep all the v. way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, it, but the deep V also has like lapel. So, oh, it's a vest. You see when he moves? It's a vest. Vest, baby. We're talking about I don't vests. See a vest. We talk- oh, yeah. You see, kinda. there's yeah, no sleeves. Right, right, it's, a right, right, it's a vest. So then he's doing vest, capelet. You know, has a doing belt harness. You know, but you know he has a sword, so we'll give it to him. You know, he needs to hold up his sword. You know, he needs to. It's a giant um, throbbing sword. And, and compared to Soul Bad Guy, because they're rivals, what do do is 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 a better? I feel like it's I would go different. for him. Listen, his oh. his. His, like, choir boy slash lesbian haircut, I don't know so much about this. Mm, but it is very anime hair, yes, just in general. Yes, so yeah. It, it's it's very pretty boy, very delicate, mm-hmm. you know? It's very delicate. He loves Jesus. Um, I think. I don't know if Jesus fucking exists in Guilty Gear. But well, why are the crosses there? Like, I don't know. On his legs and on his shirt, too, it looks like another, Kel- like, a small cross. I No, I think it's just a cross. Like, like an actual, like, X me, X, yeah, I, I don't know. You know. Should Jesus be added to Guilty Gear? Probably. I the time know. of retribution. But I mean, three I, days later. What? What is? What is your? What is your over under on? And they didn't do cool, too wild with colors either. You know, they kept it all. Like, wait a minute. Oh, have you seen a new? I've seen something. What? What have you seen? Why is the arm holding the sword dark? And the other one. Oh, so then it's not a vest. Yes. Did he he's just got rip one, one arm off? off? Yeah. He's got no, one. but wait, the guy in fucking orange, April O'Neil over here. Uh, but that's <laughs> just another color. Though. Yeah, but it's black too. So why wouldn't it be yellow? No, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter what he's got. It's what no, maybe his arm is like necromancy and it's black. No, I don't. I don't. I don't think so. Because look, look at his fingers on that arm. Okay, but do you see what I'm saying? 
Yes, I do. April O'Neil is still black on that side, holding the sword. Yeah, but look at his fingers on both of them, on that arm. They're still red. Maybe it's a tattoo that ends at his wrist. Okay, what do you give him? Okay, I give him good. I was just nitpicking because I want to know about this arm, but it doesn't change my verdict. Still pretty good. Still pretty good. Yeah. Okay, okay. May. All right, everyone, get on to your dolphins because it's, it's time to splash into May here, a pirate girl. Can you tell? Because she has an anchor as a weapon? Jesus, take the wheel. No, what is this? What? What's wrong with it? <laughs> oh, look at this mushroom head. Look, she's got a hat that makes her look like Blossom. But like, <laughs> with a skull in front? Whilst, she's a pirate. Okay. Whilst I think it is very cute for a girl to be wearing like a bulky, anchor. oversized sweater, and then like no pants, no visible pants that we can see because her shorts are too short. Shorts, yeah. And then like clunky shoes, like it's a cute look. Okay. I just noticed she has pizza stains on her thigh. Then you give her her t- princess toad or whatever hat, mushroom <laughs> hat. Toad. Hat. Shut the door. Yeah, and then her little backpack, which is not the same orange, but it's like a beige. Yeah, it's slightly off. So you're here. fighting with this giant anchor, but like you need to have your switch in your backpack. Yeah, like, yeah you do, you do. I agree. I agree at least that, a girl okay. who's in like aqua, it's like a different color, so it looks way cuter. But again, they, they did the same like color palette, which is a little bit meh. So really, she's a pirate. She's a walrus. <laughs> Those tricks. She is. Because she's an anchor. Yeah, yeah, she's a pirate. And that's not even like a canonical skull of like treasure map skull. It's like a cute puffy skull. It is, but she would have a cute puffy skull. Because like, she's a cute pirate? Yes. No. That's that's what I think, at least. Uh, All right, so what else do you feel? Like, what about the shoes? Like I said, it's cute because she just has like the big puffy sweater and like bare legs and the, the you know, kind of big platformy booties. I guess it's fun. <laughs> I, don't... I guess it's fun. Look, I'm trying to see to the design, like, and not, I'm trying to look more at the design and not the, the color palette, because that's what's throwing me off. Mm, I mean, okay. also, I'm not a fan of this hat. Oh, yeah. Yo, but like, is she a train conductor or is she a pirate? All aboard the fucking submarine express? Like, what is happening? I think it's like for a pirate, they kind of go, whatever, just have like a skull somewhere. It doesn't matter what else you do. Do you know how many designs of pirate hats there are that are like cute that they could have done? I I don't know that actually. Like a traditional pirate hat. The traditional pirate hat that most people wear. Yeah, most people walk around with a fucking anchor like this. (laughs) Well, as long as they have their backpack. That has eyes. Fair enough, oh. I guess. But look! That's cute, though. That is cute, though. Ah. So I'm I'm feeling a no on uh, I'm May. I'm gonna say a meh. I'm gonna say a meh. Okay, that's Because fair she's kind of cute. She's winning me over with her She wasn't in the last this. game, so I was, ex- I was I was interested to see what you would say. I don't know. She's cute, but she's first, annoying. First, 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 like, cute, cute, but annoying. But she's annoying. Yeah. <laughs> that's probably me in a nutshell. Pretty much. Okay. Zato. Three, two, one, it's Zato one. Um, I'm not sure how much you're gonna have to say about guy in black tactical like spandex. Um and he can't he has a blindfold. You don't think I have a lot to say about oh, a belted blindfold? I guess you don't think that I feel pretty, like this has gone too that's far. That's pretty stupid of me to too say far. That actually, yeah. Like I'm about to like throw down the mic and walk out. Okay. Fair enough. Have I seen this monsieur before that I just can't remember? Uh, this nonsense. No, I think he was in the last game. I can't remember now. People Did his blindfold have a fucking belt buckle on it? Okay, how can you not have a belt buckle on it, really, Jesus when you Christ. think about Lord it? Lord Almighty. Jeez, the, 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 the budget that Daisuke and the rest of Arc System Works had for belt buckles is probably enormous. <sighs> okay, so. Yes. Couple you of s- things. You sound excited. Couple of things. Yeah. Now, I can only see this looking at the monsieur on the right with the pale yellow. Mm-hmm. Because... Um, it is showing how there is a weird loincloth situation that you would normally not see because the default guy... Called, I believe it's called the dick curtain. Okay. The dick curtain. You wouldn't have noticed it because he's all kind of different shades of like black and gray. Yeah, you wouldn't... Um, you, it's, it's harder to notice. You're right. Wow. Sassy. Like 
I'm. He's waiting for your critique. <laughs> he's, he's pointing at you. Like, the outfit is not bad or great. It's just very normal. You know, the, the flare is a little bows on top of the boots. This belt, very low slung. Very low slung. Yeah. Like, that's not keeping um, anything up. No, he doesn't even have a gun in there. No, no. It's empty. So, why is it there if I there is no weapon? I, do, I couldn't. Yeah, what's he got in there? His his multivitamins? Like, I, what's in there? Probably some belt buckles. Magic? <laughs> to replace the belt buckle on his eyes? I mean, I, they were trying to do something cute, I guess. Oh! I mean, that's a sexy pose. I mean, who we'll can give, say that we'll it's not? That. You know, what, it's what? so nothing to me. It's like I've already forgotten it. I'll remember it because of the belt on the fucking blindfold. I mean, and it'll anger me forever. You can forget that, really. But it's not enough to make me feel here or there about it. So, 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 what do you feel overall then? I feel like nothing. That's still not. We don't middle. have a chibi for that. Middle. Okay, middle. Yeah. Okay, nothing. <laughs> to commission some more chibis. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so Zato didn't fare too well. Who do we have next? Eno. Eno. All right, well, Eno was in the last Guilty Gear that we did. I'm pretty sure you came away with, oh, guitar playing witch. I oh, yeah. like that. I'm not going to say I don't. <laughs> this is the highlight right here. Thank God for her. <laughs> Thank God. Okay. Based Eno. I even like her in the yellow a little bit more because like mm -hmm, her mm -hmm. skin tone's a little bit dark deeper and like looks good um so wait a minute though i have a question mm -hmm. so this thing flapping in back of her it's a cape but the cape that only comes from like her waist butt down cape. it's a butt cape you know what she's forgiven mm -hmm. yeah um this this buckle this belt buckle you can't see it too much because the guitar massive, hides though. it it is obnoxiously large it is too much and do i love that they made it beige instead of black which would have gone with the rest of her outfit like black and red and white um i don't love that they made it beige it okay. is actually not holding anything up because there is a guitar strap she doesn't have a weapon it is it unnecessary. Is it is just it's there. It's just there to you be there. You have to accept it. These you little black to. castle flat, like, uh, pieces on the bottom of her, like, weird butt flap thing. Yeah, I see them. Also kind of unnecessary. Um, I love her shoes. Her shoe booties. They're amazing. I would Booty. even say, like... Shoebies. Shoebies. Um, they're gorgeous. They're perfect. This is how you wear a bolero. Other guy, take note. <laughs> um... So bad guy, put on blast. You right? And it's just streamlined, it's perfect, has her little feminist display in the front. We're like, yes, her little sorting hat. Um, <laughs> telling her that she's Gryffindor, you know, whatever. I I think you know it would be Ravenclaw or Slytherin, maybe. Mm, I mean it's red, but okay. And I don't know her eyes if she's wearing like glasses, like she round is. glasses. She is there, the Cause she's so cool. When you play guitar, you gotta shred it and forget it. You know, like <laughs> I don't know. Nice. Um, she's great. I'm not gonna say anything bad about her. Yeah. No, Even though there's things that I'm like, eh, eh. but um, no, 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 no. She gets a pass. She gets a thumbs up. She gets a hard eyes. Yeah. No. She's she's she's, 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 strutting, usually, she's, she's rocking usually it in the top. Uh, the top. Oh yeah. Like, like five percent there like look at her no she knows it look at that knows. confidence look at that backwards walking yeah yeah, yeah. she's not even looking to who's behind her no she's at just... all she's strumming okay okay i'd be surprised if you if you weren't into her so oh, that's good. So that, her. that's a big yes oh yeah oh yeah angie mito all right so you know Ooh, in case in, in, in case everyone wants to see nippleless chests but bursting abs here we have angie mito i feel like this is in <laughs> anatomically incorrect like you can't you have mean? this many abs uh, every time i go in the mirror and i'm like yeah there's too many ads yeah and you're like can i get them removed because they're 24 pack please um here's some dicky belts maybe not as bad as 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 chip but so do you see why okay well the difference between why this would work with the kind of almost comically oversized, you know, flesh-colored ribbon, mm -hmm. okay, 
is that his skirt is voluminous. So it matches the tone and the, you know, kind of the volume of the bottom. He's not wearing skinny pants. He's not wearing skinny yeah, jeans. That's He's true. wearing these very big voluminous pants with like a capelet thing over like traditional style. So it's okay if the belt is a little bit oversized. Okay, yeah, I see what you're saying. You know? And then on top of that, he has these huge fans. They're not tiny fans. They're not little, <laughs> little katana fans. You would love those fans. Yeah. <sighs> Bitch. So, like... It's all very proportionally large at the bottom. Then he has his weird mutant chest. So disgusting. And his tiny glasses. Yeah, and his tiny little librarian glasses and yoga headband. (laughs) Yeah. Okay? Um, But I do like how the sleeves, too, are very traditionally, like, long, flowing kimono style. So... I really actually like this design a lot. Cool, okay. Yeah, I really do think it's so cohesive. The color scheme works. The things that are extravagant and, you know, big are proportional to each other. So, Mm -hmm. I mean, the chest is a little freaky. It is freaking me out. Like, unrealistic beauty standards for men. We were not here for that. But I think it looks good. I mean, I'm going to need... I'm going to need to work out at least for another month before I get there, you know? Like, maybe three weeks. Maybe three weeks, if, yeah. I, if, I, if I really, really push it, but... So that's a big yes for Andrew, Yeah, and then. look, when he when he does the move... Do the move, do the move. In the back, it's like open back. So yeah, he also is. wants to show his delta. What are there the you go. What are those muscles called? I don't back? know. I don't, Traps, ha- delta. I don't, don't have them. We don't have no, Nobody knows. No muscles in the McMuscles house. <laughs> um, that's why it's a funny name. Yeah. I won't um, Yeah, no, I like it. I like it a lot. Big thumbs up. All right, cool, cool, cool. Leo, Leo White Fang. All right, this is Leo White Fang. He was in the previous Guilty Gear that we did. Uh, big Maximilian favorite, Leo White Fang. Really? Here. Yeah, blonde guy with swords. I'm shocked. <laughs> But, like, are they swords? Because they feel like they're attached to his hands. And they're they're like also full... Jesus crosses, kind yeah. of, a little bit. Those little pointy boots. I'm stuck in this. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> this uh, mode. I don't. Know. I okay, feel like his default would be way better if the coat was red. Yeah. Like keep the blonde, but like see how the blonde. I think they did it on purpose. The like fur the fur kind of goes into his hair, hair, yeah, yeah. almost the exact shade and consistency and shape. Yeah. Um, Do but you know? if he can open his arms a little, if you can like. Nee, nee, nee. Um, I do like this weird. Is it a? It's a double-breasted, like motorcycle-y vest, but with a big lapel with studs on it. It's kind of cool. Um, his pants are giving me some weird vibes. Okay. So, do you like how it contours to every every single aspect of the knees? No, because look, <laughs> these are not tight pants, so they're loose, <laughs> but yet they contour the muscles, so they make no sense. Do you understand? Something in Guilty Gear makes the so sense. What? No, but you know what I mean. Like they're not like we've seen the characters that they make like form-fitting, almost tights on the men, and yes, the muscles define. But these are quite obviously baggy in the crotch to the knees, yeah. yet still muscle defining. So can someone explain the those, logic? Those are unrealistic beauty standards. Yeah, and then it goes kind of tapered at the bottom, but again, they're not tight, they're not like skinny. So like, how is your muscle showing through loose baggy pants? I don't know, but it's amazing. Anyone ask Max that? No, I don't think Maybe I will next time I talk I mean, to maybe, him. Maybe, maybe you will. Be like, maybe you will. Can What's up with Leo White Fang? Like, look at the bulbousness in the crotchular area. There's a lot of room there. There's what are what are you hiding? I don't understand. Yeah. Like, do you see how like his thigh, the top of his thigh, when it moves, it's loose. It's a mystery. Ugh. Okay. The the design concept is not bad. Mm-hmm. It's like this coat. Listen, a curt. A coat with, like, a fur collar and you're trim. You're never going to say no to Never going to say no. Even put some crosses on the arms. I don't care. I'll fucking Yeah, let's throw a th- thousand crosses on. Throw Who them. Cares? Throw them on there. And the fact that it's over, like, he's wearing a white shirt and then the black vest and then these white unexplainable pants. <laughs> um, not, I don't even mind these pointy-toed, two-tone booties. Because they had that little studying on the ankle that I like, that are reminiscent of, like, classic biker boots. Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah, I yeah. don't mind that studying. How many belts? You know, 
As many as you can throw on. A belt on for me. the vest, a belt for the pants, an unexplained belt under the pants. There's three belts yeah, on I his waist. Yeah, I've seen it. I've seen it. That's why I just enumerated to you. Look, he's so happy that he has three belts. He's doing the Russian dance. <laughs> um, so that last one, too, with the flappy flap, just hanging down, free-flowing, unnecessary. So... I don't know what to say about this. Like, how I feel a verdict, because there are things about it I like, but... He's, he's even, waiting for your I, judgment. He's I loving it. I kind of like the weapons, the yeah. color scheme, almost the line. If they had just decided, you want to be baggy pants, you want to be form-fitting pants, you cannot do both. You yeah, can't. Yeah, maybe you're right. It's it's it, it, it's a lot. I think I liked them a bit better in the the previous game. There's I'm not sure if they changed the color scheme here, but there's something there's something about it. I th I think it's because he does get lost in his hair and, and the yeah, and the that's, fur in the back I mean, it's a not little great. bit. It's not great. I think maybe they they made the hair like a more of a canary yellow. Like make the hair the color of the coat. That too. That Imagine too, that, perfect. That, 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 that might Beautiful. Work. That might work, yeah. So I'm just gonna give it an okay. You're gonna give him an okay. So that's yeah, a middle. I don't hate it. It's just not enough road. for me to like it. All right, no, I I, res I respect it. Faust. Faust. <sighs> Absolutely not. Oh. <laughs> Absolutely not. <laughs> absolutely not. So. I, I heard you say absolutely not. Absolutely not. So this is Faust. He's I, I feel crazy. like I've seen this man before. He was in the last game. Okay. Was he, he, like, he wasn't wearing, I don't think he was wearing a doctor's uh, scrubs, but, or, or nurse scrubs, but you can see he has a giant scalpel. His other, he's, he's got like a, a, a syringe uh, uh, coming down from the dick. Syringe harness. It's a, it's a syringe harness, yes. You know what? You love it. The more I'm looking at it, actually. Um, mm, okay. Um, is that the sneakers are actually quite cute. They are pretty snazzy for they him. They are. Yeah. And they're very, like, they do go with scrubs. Like, when you work in a hospital, you actually absolutely need to have comfortable shoes. I don't know how sanitary just, oh, it makes a flower. <laughs> um, the syringe just hanging is. I don't know if it's like regulation or anything like that. And like the gloves for safety and, you know, mask life, right? Like Bag life. Bag face life. Yeah, I, I wore that for most of my high school. You know, <laughs> just one glowing eye. Yeah. Just that's there. fine. That's all you need, really. So the the orderly or doctor or nurse comes in and they got this bag on their head, with the glowing eye, and I'm just like, I'm so happy that I have healthcare. That's a doctor you can trust. You're just like, yeah, you know what? Inject me with your glowing needle, Please. crotch needle, and, spider and your face. spider fingers. It's original. It's different. He is. That's why he's there. And I'll say okay. At You'll first, okay. I was like, please get out of my face. I don't want to witness this. So, so he, what's an okay? It's a scalpel. His thing, his knife is a scalpel. Like, that's, it's just, it's so creative. Yeah. Do you yeah, know what yeah. I mean? Like, it's different, it's creative. He just ate you and then spit you out of uh -oh. a dimension. Okay. Well, that's cute. So, I like this backup walk, though. Like, yeah. Go <laughs> I mean, that's all right, too. <laughs> this backup walk is great. So yeah. Le Le Leo White Fang was a meh, and he and you're you're giving Fost a yes? No, I'm giving him a, a meh. A, a meh, okay. Yeah, that's no. That's higher than I thought you'd give him. Yeah, no, me too. I thought he was going straight down the toilet. But then I was like, no, it's actually pretty No, Yo, cool. you brought that shit back up from yeah, the toilet. Yeah, like a plumber bringing up old shit. <laughs> um, so, I know. He's well done. Axel, Axel Low. Let's see how low we can get with Mr. Axel Lowe. Um, he was in the last game, but he had on these big jorts. What in the Avril Lavigne is happening? Wait, what's wrong? <laughs> it's not bad, but like he British? Ax is he Axel Rose, but British? I think, yeah, me is sure. No, yeah. what's happening? Well, what about his belt buckle? What's that saying? No, to you? yeah, yeah, I think the he tartan is. plaid of his football jersey. It it is a plaid football jersey or like varsity jacket. Yeah, no, it's a varsity say. jacket with plaid. Mm -hmm. To be like, I go to Harrods University. I don't know. Um, but <laughs> look at this. He's so much confidence. Mm -hmm. Look at him. That's always that's the first step in fashion to have confidence. It's the first step in anything, honestly, is, in life. Yeah. It's just have confidence. 
But but these jeans, Mama. Hmm. I don't even know if they're jeans. Well, I don't know what they Whatever are. Whatever bottoms these are, with like the stitching down the front and the big zips. I I don't so mind the shape big. of them. They look very comfy, and he's got his little like low booties, you know, that you like tuck your little harem pants into, and uh, yeah, but you know, a combo of the stitching. The giant zippers, the buckle, the belt, the belt on top of the vest, and then your varsity jacket, and then your weird do-rag with an X on it. And there's probably a couple of belts we're not seeing. Mama, the, like on the, inside. the delusion to be this confident, like I wish it upon, you know, myself that I could be so confident and delusional <laughs> right. simultaneously. Amazing. Um... No, it's gonna be a no for me. It's gonna be a no. It's gonna be a no. Okay, because I, I I think this is a better costume than he had in the last one. But this may, is better. May, maybe not by like a whole bunch. Okay. Is uh, it used to be like you know it's a lot of similar stuff like when he first came came out in the, like the first game, but like yeah, it's it's it it there it's a little messy. I think it gets a little messy in the jacket. Personally, the blue of the shirt is also honestly a off. like the jacket know. by itself is actually cute. Like it's something super wearable and adorable. Um, not combined with everything else going on. This is this is a hot mess. Um, he hurt someone, at and they did this to him. At the same time, though, if he's trying to be like a, a punk British guy, maybe he doesn't care about trends like that, and he's living punk, his own truth. Brit punk. There's so many other cooler things that you could have done. That is true. Than this. That is true. This I'm, is lazy. I was, I was just, <laughs> this is lazy. And unacceptable. Just, it's unacceptable. So that's a big no. No, for it's Axel. a no. It's a big no for Mr. Axel Lowe. No. Potemkin. Watch, geez, there's not enough screen real estate to show Potemkin is in his full thing. Yeah. Ew. I, you know, I, if someone's to say to me, do you think Crime Teen will like Potemkin? I'd probably, probably be like, no. He was in the last game, uh, maybe slightly different, but yeah. Okay, well, he reminds me of that other big grossy from, that big sopping grossy from Skullgirls, the big band. Oh, yeah, yeah, right. It is, it is, yeah. They have similar bit. shapes. But not like at all design. I know that. Mm -hmm. um, so like, what's with this helmet? Was he like a? He's a military like, guy. That's all I know. Military. That's what we're calling it. Yep. Not like the bad, the baddies. Just that's the military. The military. Okay. Um. I mean, I don't know what you want from me here. I. I. What. What, what do you want? What do you want to say? Um. Are his feet? Don't ask me about the feet. I, I, I don't <laughs> so, know. I don't, don't ask know. you about the feet, yeah. the pants, the arms, the head, the torso. I mean, I feel like these games must incorporate one, like, large, robot, not real thingy. Yeah. Because I... Is there a market for it? Does someone always want to play, like, this yes, big grossy? Yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, well, I give him, like... Four sopping grossies out of five. Like, I don't... What is that? I don't know. He's not great. I don't have four <laughs> chibis of you. What is that? It. It. Listen, Just personally, it if you like this, it's, I guess, designed okay. But I do not like it. And this is my personal opinion. She does not Never like forget. it. Never forget. <laughs> I don't speak for anyone but myself. And I don't like it. So that's a no. That's a no. Okay, but you gave it a four out of five earlier. Because to be a sopping grossy. Like, yeah, it's good. yeah. No, I, I get you. Okay. I don't know what I, mean, that I, means. I, I, I don't even know what I'm saying. He has me all befuddled. I, I can understand that. Not that's really. Fine. It's like I'm just like I'm not even like shocked and repulsed. I'm just like no. Yeah. No. Thank no. You. Just no. I get like, you. Like pass. It's a pass for me. It's a pass. Okay. Ramlethal Valentine. Try saying Ram Lethal Valentine three times fast. I thought it was a B. I thought it was Bam Lethal. <laughs> no, it's the much cooler name of Ram Lethal. So you like capelets, I'm told. Yeah. Uh, Ram Lethal was in the last game. Uh, yeah. They are also in this game. Yeah. They have two giant swords being held by little winged things. So I can see that people is the the default one white yes yes i can see people liking this just for her 
weird sexy peekaboo moments mm-hmm. that she's wearing a diaper underneath. I don't know. I don't think it's a uh, diaper. It is a white boy cut short and yeah. a little vesty tank top under her capelet. Uh, her inexplicably shaped helmet um, has some shamrocks on it. Yeah, it does. Um, her thigh high is holding nothing. No weapons. Not up her pants. Just some straps. Um, was she in a hospital? Is her leg broken? We don't know. We, we don't, don't know. know. I'm asking the wrong person. Yep. I'm just asking out loud. Uh, her, she has an, also an oddly cut hair situation going on. It's a little odd. It's not the worst. It's not That's bad. good to know. It's just not like my personal <laughs> preference but try, i see you're trying so hard i see the appeal like i see the kind of cuteness in it but um, also the lethalness of it and yeah. lethal it's okay we're gonna we're gonna settle with it's okay because wow uh, you know somehow her gauze is burgundy there's her hair and yeah, there's her hair. Um, her voluminous capelet has these little flowing guitar picks coming out from the bottom. Um, I, I wish that the little sentence above their name would say her luminous capelet hides her guitar picks. No, I mean, they're, they're there. Um, and it's one of those, like, showing a little, but yet being covered up, which I like. She's not, like, just, like, overtly, like, I'm in a bikini, dead or alive. Um, but it's it's cute. Like, she has, again, confidence in her walk, like, Axel or whatever. That helps, but, like, that helps, right? It's, it's giving, it's, it's swaying me. Like, she's okay. just confident in this look, so I'm like, is it okay? <laughs> like, is it good? Is it me that's Maybe wrong? Maybe it is. You know, because she seems very confident in herself, so... I gotta give it to her, you know? I'm gonna say just okay, just like meh, but like, it's not bad. Okay. Give her that. Okay, no, well, we, we have one more character left. Mm-hmm. Uh, I felt compelled to do the game while it was like kind of new and not wait for, for DLC characters because who knows what they'll be. Uh, but mm-hmm. we've literally saved mm-hmm. the best for last. Yeah. Giovanna. Giovanna. This is this is Giovanna, which uh, she is a max out on offensive rushdown super powered secret service agent. Mm-hmm. Um, and you had opinions on Giovanna when she was first uh, revealed. I, I, I should did. say. So let's 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 just breathe it in. Let's just delve deeper. <sighs> it's okay. It's gonna be all right. So as Giovanna, her Oof. puppy dog is with her at all times. Okay, oh, bellissima. Look at her. I am noticing now that the detail on her shoes, I mean, the green doesn't match so much her uh, her cuffs, but, but it, it matches, matches her, her puppy. Dog. Yeah, yeah, it matches the pupper. I like how they can't even make her stand still. She's just always like face down, ass up. That is the most ass up that you can possibly, I don't even think that's like mostly like obeying the laws of physics. Yeah, because her back's like curved and almost breaking. Yeah, but, yeah. It's... You know, it's giving out us what the people want. Is she turning green? Yeah, it's because of her powered up state or whatever. So she's like kind of huh. hulking out now. Well, I mean, listen, it's a classic outfit. It's a classic, you know, white men's shirt. And uh, I believe they're almost like a sailor cut pant. They're like a, a wide leg. That's the biggest pant. pants I've seen in a while. There are unnecessary butlets and belts. Uh, I did give it a pass. Just because I do like her design so much. Mm-hmm. Because I really like her hair. I like her skin tone. And the one thing I would say is, yes, I'm not... I'm a fan of the shoes. I am aware they have little puppy paws underneath, which is super cute. Mm-hmm. But they look a little out of place. Because they look like a comical, like, cutesy shoe you would wear on, like, St. Patrick's Day outfit, you know? You'd think she'd be wearing just, like, a nice, Like a like, boot, boot or something. Yeah, but yeah, then if I she was right. wearing a boot, I'd be like, that's boring. So, like, you can't please See, me. Yeah, yeah, you can. You can. I know um, that firsthand. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Never, ever. Um, but, you know, she rocked all our worlds when she first came on the scene uh, as a, a little cutie. <laughs> you know? The little cutie enters the fray. You know, cool moves. No, no, I mean, she's she's a great design. I want, what am I going to say? What am I going to take it back? So, no, they are a sailor cut because they do have little buttons. Oh. 
But they're just hidden by the unnecessary belts and harness that just, attach to nothing. I mean, I never really noticed it until like looking at all the characters individually. But it's like I think every character so, had belts. When a okay, I thought you said when a pen has like a set of three buttons going upwards. It's like it's called the sailor. Like it's a sailor cut. Yeah, no, no. Um, but no, she's great. What are we gonna say? What are we gonna do? I was just like, I was just, I was sweating bullets leading up to this yeah. moment. Cause like, I know you thought you I were, would go back. I no, I, I knew you were like into her a little bit, but like, I never asked you your full, full opinion, especially like looking at her in game too. It's, you just saw like the main It's hard because they give her this, this convoluted contorted position. Oh, they're suspenders. Yeah. She's like a detective. Yeah. Secret agent. Well, yeah. whatever. Kind of, you know, in the room. Uh. Oh, good. I'm, I'm glad we got to Polar Star Coffee so we could see the bear. So that's good, too. Yeah. Uh, so that's a big yes on Giovanna. Yeah, I'm, 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 I'm Bellissimo, Giovanna. Bellissima. I'm not going to go back on my girl. Uh, that's good. So I don't know if we'll be doing the DLC characters for this game in the future unless they release a boatload. I think they're supposed to be five. Okay. Uh, but I'm, I'm very glad we ended up on, on Giovanna. We ended up in the in the correct state of Crime Tina getting a bigger proof. Yeah. Overall, if you were to, like, give your feelings on this game one way or another would they kind of level out to a like in the middle of the road or middle of the road leaning towards pretty good okay yeah because no, you've I... made me look at some shit girl i have i made like, you look i made you look at tekken 7 nasty ass <laughs> garbage garbage rats like garbage garbage rats yeah all right, well, that's it for Guilty Gear Strive. If anyone has any suggestions, I, Crem Tien, and myself can look at in the future for video game, fighting game, whatever you like game fashion, uh, let us know in the comments, and we'll see you next time on... <laughs> Crem Tien Yeah.